Hey guys, long time no see. Um, early Monday morning, just got finished dropping breasts off at summer camp. Hope y'all had a good weekend. Um, not doing much right now other than cooking some breakfast. I just made some bacon. That's all I was in the mood for. Was not in the mood for any eggs or anything like that. And um, I'm not trying to eat too many carbs. So um, there goes the pancakes. <music> But yeah, I just wanted to hop on to say good morning since I haven't hopped on the camera in a while. And yeah, um, I wanted to hop on the camera last week, you know, vlog a little bit. But then all that stuff happened with um, Austin Sterling and Philando Castile and just adding them to the tally of black men impacted by police brutality. So it just put me in a in a funk like I just wasn't in a mood to pick up the camera after that um so you know i've just been praying about you know what's happening in our world um and just praying for just the spirit and the faith for all of us but especially for the black community right now because i know a lot of people are getting very very frustrated um, and just fed up, quite frankly, with what, what's been going on. You know, especially hits home for me because, you know, I'm black and um, have a black husband, have a black son. And so it's just, you know, you don't really, it's like, for me, how, sorry I'm rambling, but um, how do you instill in your child hope and excitement for their future and to make sure they fulfill their greatest potential and stuff like that, with also mirroring those lessons with, this is what the real world is about and, and this is what you have to look out for and stuff like that. And sometimes people are going to not like you or be afraid of you or um, misjudge you based solely on the color of your skin. You know, how do you tell that to your child while also having them be excited for the future? So. I'm going to make it happen because I wanted I want him to know what the rule was about, but I also want him to know that not everybody's like that. All right, guys. Fast forward hours later, it is now after 5 p.m. and home, and I picked up Bryce. He's over there enjoying a after school snack and watching some TV. Want to say hi, Bryce? Maybe instead of a cake, you want something else? Okay. Well, um, Bryce has an attitude because um, he wanted. I gave him a small like little bag of chips <clears throat> and that wasn't enough he wanted another one and I told him that's unnecessary and now he's mad at me but that is all right I'm tired of looking like a hot mess now so I'm about to deep condition my hair so I'll show you guys what I put in it <laughs> consistency so yeah people often ask me what products I use on my hair and I always tell them that I make my own deep conditioner so that's how I make it I just never really came across a deep conditioner that I really really love um, you know I don't make all of my favorite products but I just never came across a deep conditioner I love and I've been I did a big chop probably six years ago but I stopped getting relaxed maybe seven or eight years ago oh look who walked in <laughs> I, guess, I, guess. Yeah, I heard you talk I thought you was I talking guess. like something else or something. Uh, uh, how was your day good yeah but yeah so I just like the protein pack is really inexpensive it's like a dollar um, and you can get it from most places beauty supply stores Target Walmart anywhere but um, it has protein which is what I like and it has vitamin E which is what I like and then the honey just adds shine um, olive oil you can use whatever oil you want you can use um, um, castor oil you can use argon oil you can use olive oil you can use um, shea butter as a um, instead of olive oil, you can use um, coconut oil. This guy, he's happy. He's happy now. He's be careful. I need to go for it. I need to go to the farm. I missed it. It's a boat. He went on the farm? Mm hmm. 
can't write it. But he can't write it. He couldn't write it? This is this empty stuff. And the one, two, three, four. He said, oh no, what that? That's what he said. That is what his eyes are saying. His eyes are saying like a oh no. <laughs> Look at that. It's monster. <gasps> and oh no. He did? It's the monster. Oh. <gasps> and he has it to say right now. Your turn. I just read it to you first. <laughs> He's reading this book. Your turn, mommy. I just read it to you, baby. You just read it to me too. You're trying to get out of going to bed, ain't you? It's time to go to bed, Brycey. Can you get? Can you say good night to everybody? Say good night. <laughs> say good night. Okay. Brycey, say night night. Oh my goodness. Bryce. Bless your heart. I'm not going to blow it until you say goodnight. Say goodnight. Goodnight. Say goodnight to them. Look at the camera. Say goodnight. Goodnight, Mommy. I love you. I love you. Give me kisses.